Hello, my name is Terry White, Worldwide Design and Photography Evangelist for Adobe, and it's my pleasure to give you a first look at Photoshop CC 2015 with the new export options. Now, I've got a document open here with multiple artboards, which is a new feature inside Photoshop CC for 2015. And whether you're on one artboard, one document, multiple artboards, uh, getting out quick versions of your documents for the web is one of the things that we've struggled with in the past. And it, with each version of Photoshop, especially for Creative Cloud, we keep making it easier. So now there is a new file, export, quick export. So if I do a quick export as a ping, it will ask me where do I want to save these. And here we'll save them out on the desktop in a new folder called uh, Vermilion. And we'll click create and we'll just go ahead and say open. That's it. Done. No more dialog boxes. No more, um, hey, what settings do you want? No more of that. It, th that's the whole point. It's quick. So now if I head out to the desktop and take a look, I'll notice that there's that Vermilion folder, which each one of my layouts, they're exported as a ping ready to go. So how does it decide what setting to use, what format to use, since it's not presenting you with that each time? Well, if you go up to your file menu and choose export, there's also an export preferences for the quick export. So if I do an export preferences, this is where you can decide uh, where you, how you want that to work. So if you want JPEG, PNG, GIF, SVG, transparency, yes or no for the ping, uh, quality for the JPEG, ask me each time or export them to the same as, an assets folder in the same document location, whatever you choose. So this is how you get to choose what your settings are going to be for that quick export. So I like ping. If I do ping, it will give me that each time I do a quick export, whether I'm on one page, one artboard or multiple artboards, I get that quick document. That's exactly what I need. So those are the new export options in Photoshop CC for 2015. That'll be a tremendous help for web designers or just people that do blogging and export from Photoshop all the time. And I can do that quick export and get out the document you need. Take care and we'll catch you on the next one.